Okay, this is Gamer Blave, and we are back with another episode of X-Men Origins Wolverine. If you missed last episode, or you just want to be caught up on what is going on, then guys, we are in the facility where they are making the Sentinels. And if you missed, <laughs> if you were missing the last bit of the last episode, then I, guys, I could not think of the word Sentinels, uh, or what they call these guys, for the life of me. And at least I'm pretty sure that's what they call these guys. If uh, I'm mistaken, then, well, then you can make fun of me. That's fine. Yeah, you you have uh, every right to. Personal log, Bolivar Trask. An Omega level test subject woke up during experimentation today. Twenty-three close friends and colleagues died in the radiation blast. I personally terminated the offending mutant. We cannot allow this to ever happen again. Dude, Bolivar Trask sucks. Okay, uh, I don't exactly know where we're going. But, um, this is what we're doing, guys. So, buckle up. Because <laughs> it's, it's pretty exciting stuff right here. 2,000 XP. My goodness. Guys, I gotta admit, it has been a while. Ooh, look at this. Vitality 2, so more of that good stuff. Honestly, guys, we have been taking a lot of damage lately. Personal log, Bolivar Trask. After some very deep soul searching, I find I must agree with Kevin. Whoa. Mutants will never be able to coexist with humans. They are prideful and violent. Uh, they see themselves as the next step. Well, now I'm confused. It's only logical that once their numbers are large enough, they'll exterminate us. There must have been a... I say we strike first and make sure not one of them is left alive. There must have been a way to um, go from up here. Oh, there, yeah, there is. I'm ignorant. How do, how do you get to that, though? Oh, from here. Okay, I gotcha. It doesn't let you jump. It won't let you jump to your death, apparently. I mean, it probably will from right here, but it won't from from over there. Okay. Now we're cooking with gasoline, guys. Uh, but anyway, like I was saying, I, I, I haven't played in a while, so eh, this might get a little bit rough. This might get a little bit rough. <laughs> like it hasn't been the last couple of times. It's gotten a little bit sketchy, but, but we're doing okay. I mean... Fortunately, we are uh, playing as the Wolverine here, and we've got a uh, massive healing factor, so it's very forgiving in that regard. But, I mean, guys, it should be. It should be. I mean, we're you're freaking playing as the Wolverine. You're freaking badass. Bridge controls. Okay, so let, let's let's kind of scope out. Well, I guess let's hit, let's hit it, kind of see what we're. Oh, okay. I'm guessing one of these is going to collapse much faster than the other. Let's do this. Oh, okay. Never mind. I just thought that one of them was going to collapse, guys. So. Uh, I was wrong. I thought that we were going to have to... How do I know I can trust you, darling? You obviously don't remember Africa too well. Because we totally did it. Sir, I found North. And Darkholm? Yep, found her too. And she's got a gun to your boy's head. Stand down, Colonel. We don't have time for this. Eliminate her, Logan. Logan, do you realize Stryker's asking you to commit a war crime? Ms. Darkholm is no longer entitled to the protection of the United States government. Eliminate her. Damn it, Logan. Do you even know what your mission is here? I am the government. The mission critical aspect of this operation. Yeah, I'm flagging the play on wholesale murder. Take her out, Captain. That's an order. <laughs> Sir, she's down. I'm disappointed, Logan. Wraith, tie her up. Logan, there's one more emitter to take down. Think you can handle that? Sir. Yes, sir. 
I mean, she had a gun. What was I supposed to do? Well, guys, since we'd only just started, um, then we're gonna we're gonna keep going, even though we have been kind of uh, changing uh, or, or ending the videos whenever whenever the uh, um, the time shifts. But you know, you never you never really know when that's gonna happen. So I guess I should have should have continued the last episode, you know. But uh, it had been going on for a while. Oh yeah, get ready to get wrecked. Uh, we got a couple of hunters here, but. Uh, they're not, they're not starting yet. Oh, get wrecked! Oh, gosh. That guy, that guy, uh... Oh, let's see if they like this. Ride the lightning! Okay, who wants some? Okay. Oh gosh. We didn't get that guy that time, did we? Dude, what is that move? It's 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 very difficult to time. Very difficult to time just because it's so slow. You know, oddly enough, sometimes those are the uh, the most difficult ones for me at least. Oh yeah, guys we know how to deal. We know how to deal with these these guys. We've got the formula. We've got the formula. Well, the, why, why, how is this? How are they hitting like the only stuff that's preventing them from from going over? Nice. I like it. I like it. Okay, what do we got going on here? Looks like this little ledge here will take us where we're going to go. Checkpoint. Okay. Now, is this going to, like, squirt water and blast us off? No, no. We made it. No problem. Two thousand experience, guys. We are, uh, you know, I, I was talking about it in the last one. I think, you know, guys. I don't know. I, I, I get, I get confused as to which one the last one is. But um, you know that I don't know, you know, how many more there are going to be, which is why we switched that uh, mutagen. Uh, we were running the experienced mutagen, and I don't think we are anymore. Uh. Whoa! Did we just die? I thought that guy knocked us off for a second. But nope, not quite. Not quite. Oh, nice! I didn't see how many skill points it said we had, so let's, let's check it out real quick. Okay, skills. We got... Three. We've got three skills, guys. So we can get some Berserk Healing. I mean, I don't know, maybe. I never, I literally never use Claw Cyclone. I mean, why would we when we have, um, like, Claw Spin? It's, it's so good. I could see Claw Drill, maybe. Uh... Compounds with heavy damage. Why wouldn't you? Okay, I would get heavy damage first because it says greatly increases and it's just one more. Um, but anyway, that's what I would do. Okay, guys, so this is gonna, this is just a little bit weird, but 
you know, I mean, guys, I, you know, hardly anyone watches this stuff. And I, I just thought this would be fun because I, I, I found this random book. I found this ran- <laughs> random, I know that sounds weird. I found this random book um, and it's called, I, do, I, I just, I, you know, and guys, I know this sounds dumb. Sounds dumb. This is called the Handy Dictionary of Poetical Quotations. What? You know, um, compiled by George W. Powers, author of Important Events, etc. cetera. Uh, but anyway, um, you know, I found this uh, in, I mean, my parents were just getting rid of it, basically. And I was like, man, that actually looks kind of cool. That actually looks kind of cool. And, you know, hey, I don't know what some of it might be cool. Some of it might be dumb, but I'm just going to open it randomly. And we're going to check it out because... You know, hey, may, randomly, we might just have a break for a random poetical quotation. And speaking of which, since I found it from my parents, although it says that it was, it says that it was my aunt's in it. it says that it was, it says that it was my aunt. So apparently, my parents stole it from my aunt. But um, poetical quotation about parents here: Great families of yesterday we show, and lords whose parents were the Lord knows who. Okay. Yeah. I don't, I don't, I don't get it guys. I don't get it, but that's a poetical quotation. Okay. You know, stand by. We might, we might have more of these. We might have more of these and Lords whose parents were the Lord knows who. Okay. So, I mean, I guess presumably uh, that means, um, that someone, uh, or that, that, that was, uh, uh, th- th- some people have some questionable parentage there. And that was from, I guess, 1300. Oh no, that's quote 1300, but that is, uh, by Defoe, the true born Englishman, part one, line one, true born Englishman. Anyway, guys, I thought that was a cool book. We may revisit that in this, in this series or in maybe other series guys, because you know, I might just start doing random crap because I feel like it. <laughs> okay. Anyway, where were we? We were climbing this freaking thing because that's what we do. That's what we do. In the past, in the past, it seems like we're pretty much doing, um, you know, like a, uh, a kind of like a, almost like a Far Cry or Assassin's Creed type. Uh, what's going on here? Assassin's Creed type. Um, can we climb these vines um, thing where we're basically just climbing crap all the time. But it's all good. Oh, I guess that just slaughtered those dudes. Wrecked. We're way too powerful for these dudes. Way too powerful. Of course, I mean, what are you supposed to do? What are you supposed to do, guys? When you're fighting against the Wolverine. I don't think there's much you can do. Unless you're Magneto. Or you're using Cerebro. Uh, what's going on with this with this thing? Yeah. Having a bit of an issue. Nice. Yeah. Whoa. No. You're done. Did did she go over? Looks like it. All right. Okay, cut it out. Slowly but surely. Okay. 
That's enough of that. These guys need to settle down. Oh, that one's already dead. <laughs> oh, is there one down there? Oh, they, they all those guys lived. That's that's kind of kind of funny. Uh, that guy's just gonna keep spawning dudes, and some of them are gonna die. And uh, anyway, I don't need to deal with that. I guess I can just do this. The formula didn't work quite as well there, guys. Didn't work quite as well. But I'm gonna blow this place sky high, so it doesn't really matter. That's how we do it. The last emitter's down. That was a somewhat more graceful landing than the last one. We just cracked our head on that rock. You're still breathing. You know the deal, Logan. First we find Wraith, then I'll tell you everything. Let's just through those doors. <clears throat> yeah, guys, that's not good. Yeah, that's that's super not good. Are these hands going to do stuff to me as well? Yeah, eat that. Ooh, another mutagen. Guys, they're really hitting us with a lot of mutagens these days. Inner Rage 2. Um, gain extra rage from each kill. I don't know which ones we have active, but... Seems like we're doing okay. I'm not sure if this is the way that I'm supposed to be going. Seems like we've already been here. Though. Oh no, no, this this guy's new. This guy's fresh. I mean, I'm just guessing. Testing sector. Data shows they've been prototyping hand lasers for the Sentinels. That might be our ticket to destroying the Sentinel head. Okay, yeah, let's blast this thing. Leave while you're still breathing. All right, chucking. Guys, when we can, we do. I mean, we could stab these guys, but why? When we could chuck them to their deaths. Representative Kelly, it's recently come to the committee's attention that Project Wide Awake has been developing sentinels. What exactly are these? Think of them as robotic peacekeepers. They are being designed to counter almost any mutant power. So they're meant purely as a defense system. Rampage three. They would only be deployed in the event of mutant riots. Yeah, that's what they all say. Okay, what does this do? Uh, hold it to use the track controls. Yeah, okay, so we need to climb this ladder and then put the track in place because for some reason the track is just hanging out there. That's just what it does. That's like a thing that that they're doing with it. Personal log, Representative Robert Kelly. I absolutely despise uh, meeting with Colonel. Strider. I'm gonna climb up here just to check and see if there's something up here that we need. 
bribe him with information on the location they don't see anything up here that we need New York State I've been looking into the creation of my own team X so I don't have to rely on striker the day that happens I'm going to inform him personally just to watch the smile fade from his smug face go 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 Okay, so that's kind of unnecessarily stressful. Okay, come on, guys. What's the deal with these? Well, these things are just irritating. That's all they are. They don't really do anything ever blow my skin off which i mean you know hey if you were anyone else that'd be a pretty big problem <laughs> i mean uh, let's be real here most people you know need their skin personal log bolivar trask i've done it i've developed a machine that's not only capable of detecting mutants but it can also terminate them. It's still only in its initial phase of planning, but once they're in full production, Sentinels will have no trouble in combating the Mutant Menace. The Mutant Menace. Go, 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 go. Bloop. Uh-oh. All right, let's let's put a pin in that for a second. Logan, you've got to get that sentinel hand to the upper floor. It's the only way we're going to get past that sentinel head and rescue Wraith. Uh, sounds good. But I saw this and I want it. We're taking this. Ooh. Okay, so how does this go up? Uh, that doesn't go up. That kind of sucks. Does 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 this do something? Nope, that doesn't do anything. Oh, we need a we need a we need a power cell. Guys, I haven't seen one of those recently. Did I miss one somewhere? This thing... is kind of pulling me in this direction. It looks like it's pulling me... yeah, right towards this. That doesn't help. Oh man, guys. Where was it? I mean, it could be anywhere. Oh man, that, that sucks. Because this place, this room is fairly substantial and I did not see it. I guess let's get some elevation, see if we can scout it out. I mean, they're pretty obvious usually, but uh, I did not spot it. I mean, I'm sure I walked right past it. I don't see one over there. You can't open this up. That is weird. Okay, let's go up here again. It might have been that second level that, you know, up there that I was like, oh, there's nothing up here. Oh, great. I don't know why that jump is hard. It kind of like blocks you. At least it feels like it does. It feels like there's an invisible wall there. Uh, so hopefully we don't have to do... Hopefully it checkpointed when we got the hand down. Um, because... Okay, good. It did. So let's try that again. And see if we can actually get it this this time okay and then see wait a second oh we haven't got that um experience though 
because it was prior to that. Guys, I don't see it. Maybe... You know what? I have no idea. I really have no clue. Um... Where's the way out of this room? Like, how did we get in here? Wait. I am, I am a little bit, like these teleporters only come, only work coming in, right? They don't, you cannot go out, needs power. We can't go out these. Um, okay, let's see if we if we can blast something here. So let's see rotate There we go Eat this guys All right, guys. You just gotta you just gotta kind of read, uh, read read the room, so to speak, and also you know the the instructions because it's like, hey, you know, you, you can just you know use this to blast stuff. So obviously you need to blast stuff. So that makes sense. I don't know what this guy was doing hanging out in there, all by his lonesome. So that looks like it's a promising lead right there. And then this, of course, has nothing in it. I wanted to check to see, you know, there could be a mutagen or, you know, some extra health or something like that in, in those rooms. But, no. But this looks like what we need right here, guys. Yeah, that one took me a little bit longer than it probably should have. That was the hardest puzzle yet. I know, with the exception of those, um, I mean, in the past, you know, those gates that uh, we haven't been able to figure out. We can lift them up, but I haven't been able to figure out how to get past them before dropping them down. Uh, we've encountered two of those that I haven't been able to figure out yet. Well, I haven't been able to figure out, period. It's not like we can go back to them. Whoa, what's going on here? Okay, so we got to get over to that and then somehow get it all the way back to... Um, I would like to welcome the new Whoa. members of the Project Wide Awake Committee. What do we get now? Samurai 3. I know that we are of one mind now. And that we will accomplish great things. Thank you, Representative Kelly. We look forward to following your lead in protecting mankind from the mutant menace. And with that, let me introduce... Uh, I can't really tell where this thing is right now. Single most powerful fighting weapon known to mankind. I intend on building an army of these. Oh wait, so hold on, oh, wait. Uh, now I'm really confused. Every living mutant. An excellent idea, sir. You have the committee's full backing. Well, uh, I mean, I guess there? Well, where do we want to drop this one? Guys, this is weird. Okay, so that one, that one comes back here. Regardless. Guys, I don't know what's happening, but let's go ahead and teleport out there. Then we'll get a better idea of what's going on. Oh, okay, so... So we're gonna...
it's going to bring us through the purple one. Which means... I don't know what the purpose of going to the other side of that would be. But I guess what we want to do is leave it here. And then when we let that thing go, it's going to come back. And we just want to... Okay. Oh, okay. Never mind. I get it. I get it. I get it. We use the other one to block this one. Coming back. I'm picking up what you're putting down. I'm picking up what you're putting down. I'm a little slow on the uptake, guys. Okay, now we're over here, so whatever good that does us. Uh. Personal log. Boulevard, Trask. Several test subjects. Let's jump through the blue one and see what that does for us. Facility without authorization. Two innocent people died and six others were injured. I have tried to keep an open mind towards mutants, to treat them as equals, but I don't know if that's wise anymore. Okay, we got <laughs> assault and battery. I like it. All right, guys, we got the goods. Do we have to plop this down? Cannot use elevator while carrying battery. All right, now we're good, guys. I like that our shirt eventually regenerates, you know? It'd be unfortunate if it didn't. Oh, great. Okay, hang on a second. Eat this. I'm just getting started. Okay, that guy's dead. And that guy's dead. Okay. That's how we do it, guys. That uh, I mean that claw spin is so good. It's so good. Oh, you guys are toast. 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 Dude, this thing's rapid fire, man. It's not even screwing around. I mean, you know, guys, when when you have a turret or the the equivalent, which is this in a game, you've got to spawn it on enemies. It's the rules. Although these days, you know, they like like to subvert expectations a lot. So like every now and again, you'll like get on a turret and then there's like, where are the guys? Where are all the dudes at? Well, why can't I shoot at him? Oh, nice. Keep blasting. More blasts. More blasts. I would blast several more times. Heads up. Heads down. It's more like it. I mean, if you, if you ask me. Um, you know what, guys? 
I actually, you know, I mean, God, dagummit. I, I mean, I, I, I hate to, uh, I hate to cut it off when, uh, when the, when the, when, uh, you know, something interesting might be about to happen. You never know, you never know. But, uh, but that actually seems like a pretty decent place to cut it. Uh, pretty decent place for an episode uh, ending. We just wiped out. We just obliterated. Well, I mean, you know, who knows? Uh, but we just blasted at least that uh, sentinel head. That's pretty cool. That's pretty freaking cool. Um, so, anyway, anyway, I'm a, I'm a fan of I'm a fan of that place as a as a good ending um, for for this episode, which uh, you know. That's that's pretty good symmetry. We started the episode like near that head. You know, we had just kind of come upon that head, and now we blasted that head. So that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Uh, pretty good symmetry there. But anyway, guys, as always, thank you so much for watching. We're gonna be picking up right here next time. Let's do this.